Hey, so, Chris Spiker at Jet Hawk Stadium. It's Beer for the Brave Night 2016. Lots of people here. All the different uh, military organizations represented. Tell us who you are. Um, I'm Senior Airman Jesse Rawls, Edwards Air Force Base. Jesse, what's your special job tonight? Uh, tonight we're volunteering to uh, basically DD for anybody that needs a ride home. Um, this is a base program and uh, Beers for the Brave reached out and asked for some volunteers. So there's about eight of us here tonight that are going to help people out. Well, we took some still shots, so we'll add that into the video. Appreciate your service. Thank you for your service. Thanks for being here. Right on. Thank you for your support. I hope that your comrades in arms uh, have a great evening. Appreciate it, definitely. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, the fact that I, I spent uh, four years in the Coast Guard during World War II, I uh, spent time at, uh, at the airplanes and I uh, ended up at the end of the war I was working on a troop transport and we were carrying the troops to the different uh, islands and we carried about 25 landing craft and uh, but I was telling him what really made me feel good is when we start bringing the troops back to the Pacific. At the Golden Gate, the limp would be out there with a big welcome home across the Golden Gate. They had a huge sign of gold welcome home. And when you pull up to the dock, everybody cheering, the bands are playing. It made you feel good. It's certainly different than it was for Vietnam. They treated them like scum. They treated the World War II veterans that came back good. And and we're still uh, appreciating our World War II vets. <laughs> Mr. Long, right? Yeah, I'm 94 years old. 94. <laughs> and who's going to win the baseball game tonight? <laughs> the Jet Huck. <laughs> Well, thank you for your service. Chris Spiker for AV Nice. We're at the Jet Hawk Stadium. This is August 13th. It is Brews for the Brave. And you are? My name is Matt, and I'm a ticket taker over here at the Jet Hawks. And I like my job most days because I like baseball. But today, when I found out that I was actually going to be taking the tickets by hand from our active servicemen, it really felt like an honor. I'm a huge military supporter. All of my family is served, and it's really nice and a very great thing to actually help just be a small part of. I wish more sports teams would do something like this. So it's one of those days where it really made me feel extra special to be a part of this. Hey, did you get to say hi to anybody? I shook everyone's hand and thank them for their service, as I always do when I'm out, because I feel like that's the appropriate thing to do for everything that, everything that they do for us. Well, Matt, I wasn't military either, but you know, thank you for your service. Thank you, sir. You bet. I appreciate it. Rolling. It's buffering. Tech Sergeant Bird here. I'm here with two of my favorite people, Trish and Dar Darrell Baldozer. So, I have a few questions for him. Number one, you've been in the Air Force a little while, right? Just a few years. Just yes. a few years. Have you ever seen anything quite like Beers for the Brave? Absolutely not. Yes, this is wonderful. So would you think that this is something that we should do across America? We've already given a couple bases where we think this would be a good thing to do it at that base, actually. Wonderful. Wright Patterson Air Force Base has the Dayton Dragons right next to them. That would be a great second place to start. The Midwest is a wonderful area and the temperature and the base would, I think, would really support this. This would be great um, in conjunction with the Air Force Marathon, which is um, being held in uh, September in, uh, at Wright-Patterson. So we've talked to, to a couple, we've spoken to a couple of the brave. Yeah. Now let's talk about beer. <laughs> wow, is, is this good beer or what? This is excellent beer. This is, is this a Bravery Brewery beer. Bravery Brewery. Yes. Gotta so, give them a plug because they are awesome. They really are great. Cheers. <laughs> Bart, we love you. Yep. Just so. need a driver. <laughs> That's right. This is awesome. Great, great night for it. So would you say that this is a pretty family friendly event? Yeah, actually it is. It's a really great family event. I'm surprised there's not more uh, people here. And um, yeah, I'm surprised. I think we need to next year uh, really advertise this as, as a family event for the people on the base to bring the kids out here. The Jet Hawks here do a great um, promotion for the kids and she needs something too they 
You want nachos and what else? Just nachos. Okay. And a drink. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of drink? Diet Coke. So, back yeah, it's a great family-friendly program. <laughs> we really need to, to advertise that. So family, yeah. friends, yeah. the brave, and beer. Yeah. Beer's for the brave. It doesn't get any better than this. And stuff. a safe yeah. place to do it. And a safe place to do it. But that guy that threw out the first pitch was kind of scary. So I might want to get a better. <laughs> you really need to work on that. Sergeant Bird, thank you. So thank you, sir. You bet. You guys are awesome. This is the coolest thing ever. This is the coolest thing ever.